This is both ecological and very economical too. You want to use 100% cotton t-shirts. Do not use a poly blend. Do not use nylon. And I went ahead and I cut up a bunch of old white t-shirts. And what you do is you fill up your container, take each one, toss them in one by one. Okay, so for this recipe, very first thing we need is distilled water. All of the trace minerals have been taken out of this water. Three parts distilled water. And so I'm gonna to count to three, that's the way I measure. One, two, three. Our next ingredient is white vinegar. I love white vinegar, because one, it's natural, but it's a very mild acid that makes it antibacterial in its property. We do three parts of white vinegar. One, two, three. Our third item is rubbing alcohol. This is really going to sanitize things that might be like salmonella or E. coli. So we did three parts of distilled water, three parts of white vinegar, we do half of that. So instead of counting to three, I'll count to one and a half. And we need one more thing. Sometimes you might spill a little oil. Maybe it's a little sticky. Anything with a fat needs something called a surfactant to break it up. And I'm using Castile soap. This is 100% plant-based and you don't need a lot. So we're just gonna do 10 drops of this. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. 10. That's it. So we put our container back on, give it a shake. Then let me show you how it works. And whoops, I made a spill. You take out one of your disinfecting wipes. You wring out a little of the excess, and then you just wipe away. The cotton is very absorbent, and the solution really gets your countertops truly clean. Oh, and the best part, they're reusable. You can just machine wash it and use it over and over again.